Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm going to talk to you today about um, the Putin uh, Modi summit um, that happened uh, in India, in New Delhi, India's capital. Now, as critical as I am of the Putin regime, and I hope they do not invade Ukraine, and if they do, I believe the U.S. needs to respond with force on Russia, if Russia invades Ukraine, and it's very possible that they will. Now, with that being said, I still think India is a great U.S. ally, and yes, Russia is selling the S-400 surface-to-air missiles to India for about 5.3 billion U.S. dollars. Now, here's the thing, though. When India and Russia develop strong ties, that also puts China at bay, and it really drives a wedge between a Russian and Chinese alliance which would be very, very bad for the United States and all and all European nations, as well as our Asian brothers and sisters in Japan and in South Korea. So India and Russia having strong ties actually weakens a Russia-China alliance, which is a good thing. And what it also does is that it can put have India put pressure on Russia to not invade Ukraine. Uh, now, with that being said, India uh, India has had strong ties with Russia for a long time, and that was when Russia mediated a peace settlement between in the Russia-Chinese War in 1962, when Russia was the Soviet Union. So India has always tried to play peacemaker between Russia and the United States, particularly for the last five to ten years. And I, and I believe, like I said, a strong India-Russia relationship uh, will uh, will help weaken uh, potential for a strong Russia-China alliance. So right now, I'm not threatened by this. What Russia is selling India is defense missiles, and those defense missiles are liable to be used against either a Chinese or a Pakistani invasion of India. This definitely, the US, United States does not have any plans to invade India. So I'm really not threatened or too concerned with the missile sale uh, that Russia has given, has offered to India. And the, the S-400 missiles selling India those missiles for the cost of 5.3 billion U.S. dollars. So anyways, everybody's doing well. Take care. God bless you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.